Good afternoon everybody, welcome back to a brand new vlog. We are on moving vlog number two now. I thought we could spend a few days together just packing up the rest of the house because currently we move next week. So we've got just over a week before we move and at the moment we have only really packed up the bedroom and we've also packed up what the hell have we packed up we've packed our clothes we packed up the dressing room well most of it anyway um we've just got my um dressing table that's left in there because obviously i do my filming there um but everything else and we've also got the mirror in there but we need to pack up the shelves which I'm going to do probably today. And I just need to pack up all of like the little bits that we've got lying around. All of that's been moved out of this room. Um, but we haven't done the kitchen at all. I do think I need to start doing some of it. Because we don't use obviously everything that's in the kitchen. So the things that we don't use like some of the glasses. Like wine glasses and stuff. All of that can be packed away. But I'm really worried about it. Because I don't want them to smash. So I have been doing a lot of googling about how to pack up glasses. Because obviously when we moved in here. Everything was in the original box. Because it was brand new. We hadn't used any of it. But obviously here, we've chucked all of the boxes away. So I've read that you should use either packing paper or like bubble wrap and stuff. So I might go out, like venture out to try and find some. I need to actually go out and get my mum a birthday card and some wrapping paper because it's my mum's birthday tomorrow and we're going out for a meal tonight. So I've got a very busy few days and then next week is just going to be absolutely manic. I want to try and get all of this done this week because it's currently Thursday. I don't work now until Monday. Monday I work from home and then obviously Tuesday and Wednesdays I'm in the office. So next week really I'm only going to have Thursday and Friday to do stuff and I think some of the things that I need to do I'm going to need Callum and he's at home at the weekends because I wouldn't make him do it after work in the week. So I feel like we're gonna have to get this done this week. So that's the plan for this vlog. It is a very packing orientated vlog. There are gonna be a few other bits as well. But yeah, I really hope you enjoy it. I can't believe that this vlog will be the one that goes up before we move. So yeah, I might venture out if I feel brave enough. I always find that going out on my own is so scary. Like I find it so daunting and I have to proper like psych myself up to do it. But it is a really nice day today. The sun is shining, it's warm. So I might just pop my over the head headphones on and just go for a walk into town because I don't have the car. Does anyone else get like really bad social anxiety? Because I do, I don't know why guys i actually went out i actually made it out on my own and i'm very proud of myself i literally just popped my headphones on and walked into town and the weather was really hot actually it's gone a bit cloudy now but it was really nice earlier but i picked up some wrapping paper i got this one i've just wrapped up my mum's presents which are here um so yeah we've got dinner tonight so i think i don't know if she's opening them tonight or tomorrow I don't know. Her birthday is actually tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, I thought this wrapping paper was really cute. It's from Card Factory. And then I picked her up a card as well. Uh, which is in here. I got her a little fancy one. Which was uh, in a box. So yeah. So all I have to do now is write the card. Um, and then yeah, that's it. But I'm very proud of myself for going out on my own. So if you're thinking about doing it, just do it pop some music on, put like your favourite playlists on, things that really help me at the moment. And I said this to my counsellor the other day, I like to pretend that I'm like in a film. <laughs> and I know that sounds really silly, but you see all those TikToks saying like, oh, you're the main character of your life, your story, blah, blah, blah. So I like to pretend that I'm in a film. So I went to the shop the other day, I went to Morrison's on my own and I was really proud of myself because that's something that I don't normally do. And for a lot of people with anxiety, you'll know what I'm talking about. Doing things like normal everyday things that most people will probably find easy and like not have to think about, I really struggle with and I really have to psych myself up for it. So I went to Morrison's, normally Callum would come with me but he wasn't feeling well or he was tired, I can't remember. He just didn't want to come so i was thinking right well 
I'm gonna try and do this myself because it's not fair like to always rely on him either. So I psyched myself up, I went out, I played my favorite music in the car. It was also raining as well, which I really like. Like I like driving in the rain. I know that sounds weird, um, but I really liked it. And I went and I parked and it took me like a few minutes to get in there. But once I was in there, I picked myself up some flowers. I bought myself my favorite snacks at the moment. And yeah. I just made it like more enjoyable and then when I got back I felt really proud that I'd done it so yeah that's what I did today I did consider getting a coffee but then I was thinking I'm on keto so it might well it would definitely take up a lot of my carbs and also I'm trying not to spend unnecessarily because obviously we're moving out and we are trying to keep as much money to ourselves so that we can spend it on furniture and stuff like that and also we've got a holiday coming up so there are more like worthwhile things to spend my money on but I did nearly get one because it was hot but I, I decided against it I'm actually pretty good at doing that now because in my head I think oh well I've got better things to spend my money on than a coffee and also I've got a coffee machine here if I ever wanted one so I could just make one at home now but by the time I got home I was like no I want a cold drink so I'm actually gonna get a drink now because I'm really thirsty again so I'm gonna get a drink of water make a cup of tea and probably edit my video that's going up this weekend i did have a look out for some bubble wrap and packing paper but guys do you know how expensive it is and how little you get like it definitely would not have made a dent in what we have to pack so i phoned callum and he said he might potentially be able to get some from his work so that's good so he's gonna ask um a bit later on he's gonna be home relatively soon so hopefully He'll have some stuff with him so that I can start packing. But that is my fun afternoon for today. We've got the bubble wrap, everyone. <laughs> like a slob. <laughs> In a slug position. <laughs> In your little vest. <laughs> little vest? Wow, yeah. you know it's a large. <laughs> Um, but yeah, we've got our bubble wrap ready for wrapping up the glasses and the plates and stuff. But I don't think I'm going to have any time to do it tonight. I'm going to do it tomorrow because we're going out for mum's birthday meal tonight. I need to get changed actually because I'm not wearing this. But I've just touched up my makeup and I think my hair looks alright. So I'll just leave it like that. But yeah, I'm going to wear a little dress because it's quite warm outside. It's like really muggy. It's not sunny anymore. But I'm going to go get dressed and then we're going to make our way to the restaurant well it's like a pub restaurant um so yeah we're gonna make our way to the restaurant good morning everybody it's now the next day um excuse my face i've just had my counseling call and i had a little cry on there just keeping it real this is the reality of therapy but i'm okay i'm i'm all right guys don't worry um so i've just got off of my call but i wanted to jump on because i'm just about to pack the rest of our glasses this morning before i had my call i was wrapping up the glasses i have wrapped up about half of them i think and i haven't put them into the boxes yet so today my plan is that i'm going to get the kitchen sorted i'm going to get my dressing room sorted and the cupboards that is the plan. I've got some boxes here. I've got, how many boxes did I bring up? We've got loads in the garage that Callum's work kindly gave him. So we have one, two, three. We've got four boxes up here, but there's loads in the garage. So if I need any more, I can go down and get some. I feel good today after therapy, guys. I feel really good. If you want to do therapy, I really recommend it. If you've been thinking about doing it, I really recommend. Um, it's just so nice to just get stuff off of your chest. I don't normally cry either so today you know that it was a it was a good session but yeah I am gonna get on and do the packing literally there's like a week and a day until we move so I need to get cracking this week we've got some bubble wrap I'm gonna get on and do it so let's go
Good morning everybody. It's now the next day. I'm just on my way downstairs because we are doing a tip run. We actually made a lot of progress today. Let me show you the garage. So Callum is currently packing up the car to go to the tip. This is what our garage is looking like. So we've got all of the stuff that was under the stairs in the garage out. All of this is from upstairs. This Everything we've packed. Yeah. We're selling this, selling this, and that's got to get to the tip, and yep. that's it. Everything else is coming with us. It's looking very empty upstairs, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, we're just about to go to the tip. All of our kitchen um, cabinets are packed. We have packed away... I've packed away pretty much everything in my dressing room that I can pack. Um, because, as I mentioned, I think earlier on in this video... I'm still going to be doing some filming this week so I've got to have like my background in the dressing room but once I'm done with the filming I think we're then going to move that but it looks very empty um you said you're going to start moving furniture didn't you downstairs with Naz yeah I think Naz is coming around later and is going to help Callum carry stuff down into the garage because I am not the best person to do that what did we try and carry down the other week and I the mirror a um, mirror. I, carry, I ended up carrying it on my own. Yeah, I couldn't do it. It was like it really freaked me out as well coming down the stairs and I was going forward as well, which should make it easier. Is that the easiest going forward rather than backwards? No, it's, it doesn't really matter. It depends how much weight you want to hold. If yeah. you're going down backwards like I was, you've got all the weight. I'm just so weak. I'm really weak. I can't help with anything really because I'm just <laughs> useless when it comes to moving things. But I've done all of like the packing and stuff. I wrapped all of the, um, <coughs> bless you. <coughs> I wrapped all of the. <laughs> oh, bless me. I wrapped all of like the breakable stuff. So like the plates, like every single individual item I've wrapped with bubble wrap and packed away. So that's all done now, which is really good. I was doing that all day yesterday. So that's why there wasn't much footage after I filmed that little clip for you because that's all I was doing for the rest of the evening. So yeah, I'm just gonna get my shoes on. I'm actually wearing my Uggs, my Tasmans. I've started wearing them again now because it feels like it's autumn. So let's go to the tip. The table's gone, everyone. It's gone. I know. We've just, uh, well, Callum's just disassembled it. It's over there. It's, um, it's all a go in our house tonight. It's actually quite late, isn't it? What time is it, like 10 o'clock? We did have a little nap earlier. Yeah, we had a busy day though. Yeah, we've had a really busy day. We've it's done fun. so much. Ooh. I've done two tip runs. Yeah, I know. Done a lot of packing. We've done a lot. As you can tell from my appearance, but um, all of the cupboards are now empty. How cute is this, by the way? Oh my goodness, I got it from Timu. Um, it's a little diffuser, which you'll see in a haul coming up. I absolutely love it, and I've got the winter oil in there. So cute. As I was saying, the cupboards are now empty. I've given them a good clean. I've wiped all of the outside as well. It's very weird. <laughs> We've only got a few things left in this cupboard because it's just stuff that we're using this week. And also... <laughs> some little bowls in this cupboard but I've cleaned all of that too so that's pretty much everything done for today tomorrow we are popping out in the afternoon but leading up to that what are we doing nothing really I still haven't done my oh, underwear drawer well, I've got to go uh, food shopping in the morning yeah to get food well, shop. we're not, we're not we're doing not a full do a food, food shop, shop no because we want to because we've got to defrost the fridge and freezer. Yeah, because we've got to uh, defrost the fridge and freezer, we're just trying to run everything down. Yeah, so we're only going to get a few bits tomorrow. Just basically work. For like, really, yeah, work. Because we've got work, well, I've got work Monday to Wednesday. Well, one of those days I'll be home anyway, but you're at work all week. So we're just going to get a few bits for work. Um obviously stuff for dinners but we're going to try and have as much as we can out of the freezer so i have decided today i'm going to pause keto for like a week or so it's going to be difficult yeah it's going to be really difficult to stick to keto this week because we are trying to use up absolutely everything that's in the freezer and a lot of it 
I think has carbs. So I'm gonna have to do that. But, and to be honest, we're gonna be having takeaways, I reckon. We did have a takeaway last night. We had our last takeaway in this house, which was a Chinese and it was so good. I forgot to show you guys because yesterday I didn't, I think I stopped filming around, I don't even know when I stopped filming yesterday. Everything's a little bit of a blur at the moment. If you can't tell, it's a bit busy. hectic. Yeah, busy, hectic. I'm finding it really difficult to remember to pick up the camera because I'm just getting stuck into everything. But today, yeah, we packed up the rest of the um, kitchen, like the cupboards. Um, tomorrow, we're gonna. I'm gonna do my underwear drawer tomorrow. I have to. <laughs> I've done everything else apart from my underwear drawer. All of my clothes are packed. They're in the garage. I've only got a small amount of clothes that are in the bedroom that I left myself out for the like couple of weeks leading up to moving, and then they're gonna go in my suitcase. But yeah, it all feels very real now, guys. We've got we're, this time next week. We'll be in our new house which is so exciting and very sad actually as well. But I'm really hoping that Jazz and Rob get this house so that we can still come back to it because we've loved it, haven't we? Yeah. We've loved living here, but we've got exciting times ahead. So yeah, as I said, tomorrow it's gonna be a very, um, probably not like as busy as today, but I'm still gonna be doing stuff. I think we're also, I've sold my mirror so we're dropping that off tomorrow as well we've sold quite a lot actually we've sold we what sold your chair oh yeah dropping off my I've chair sold the exercise bike today yeah we sold the exercise bike i'm really sad that we had to sell that because i loved it but um we just don't have space for it at all so that was sad but it had to be done <laughs> So that's it from us today because it has been a very, very long day. It's been a very long couple of days and it's been very tiring, but it's all going to be worth it. And I'll see you guys in the morning. <laughs> <sighs> Hello everyone. It's now a few days later. Jasmine's just having a little uh, meltdown. <laughs> Um, now release all of the cells that are trapped in your mind. <laughs> 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 Excuse the state of me. Um, packing has taken its toll, but I thought I'd give you an update because it's a couple of days later. I want to get this video up. Um, so I'm just going to show you what we've done. This is the state of the dressing room. Don't judge me. We are packing, obviously. So this is what the dressing room looks like. Um, I've got a video for Timu that I need to film. Um, but all of this is Callum's stuff here. I've packed up a lot of the stuff of mine here. Obviously my desk is still up because I need to film underwear. And then around the corner, there's clothes that Jasmine is gonna go through today because I need to get rid of them. Yeah, that much. Let me show you. That's how much Jasmine has to go through today. And then this is what the bedroom's looking like. We haven't got any sheets on the duvet. We've actually been living like peasants for a few days. <laughs> These are the clothes that I left out. Um, that's just a coat that was in the cupboard. So this is just the remaining of my clothes that when we move will be packed. That was just stuff that was on the dresser, um, which the dresser has now gone into the garage. We haven't got any bedside tables. There's literally nothing in here apart from a bed and we don't even have sheets. <laughs> so that is... <laughs> Jasmine, I walked past and she went, stinky bitch. Um, <laughs> that is the progress. So we can't really do much else now until the day that we actually move. So all that we've got out in the kitchen is like a few um, like pans, plates, stuff like that, that we obviously have been using and just washing up as we go. We've still got the microwave, the kettle, the toaster, all of that out because we use that day to day. So on the day that will be packed. TV unit is still there. Um, but again, we're gonna move that on the day along with the TV. I reckon the TV will probably pack up on Friday night. So that is pretty much the packing done, everything that we can do so far. So yeah, the next vlog that you'll see, it will be completely packed up because it will be like the actual moving in vlog where we start to actually move everything, which is this week, by the way. I know, mad. Um, so we've been frantically running around this past weekend, which you will have seen just 
packing up everything that we can so i really hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog obviously the next vlog that comes out will be us moving into the house which is so exciting i can't wait to do like a little empty house tour i will be filming that this week because we actually picked up the keys today so i can get in there sort of in the next few days i reckon maybe like towards the end of the week and i'm gonna film an empty house tour which is so so exciting i hope you guys have an amazing rest of your week and i will see you in the next video which will be in the new house bye